We've all seen the signs. Now hiring, scan for job application, join the family. Walk down just about any street and you'll find businesses needing workers. Why are so many people quitting their jobs? Whitney Trailer is a labor relations attorney. Ultimately, it really is about working conditions, burnout, safety, pay, all of those things. Hello. How are you doing today? So far, so good. How are you? Doing okay. Perfect. For some people like Dawn Short, it came down to just trying something new. She owns a coffee roasting business with her husband and sells it out of a pretty cool looking trailer. Once a week, she's been giving coffee away to people at the Louisville Rec Center, including to a lot of the Marshall fire victims. We've been very blessed to, to be able to do what we love to do. And I want to give back and help those people, you know, who, again, it's just a, it's a cup of coffee, it's a hot cocoa, but it's one less thing they have to worry about. Don used to work in a place like this as an analyst for a medical device company. But as her coffee roasting hobby became her business, sometimes coffee is more important than anything. She decided to quit her job and chase her dreams. It's so rewarding. You know, I mean, yeah, there's the money issue. Can you afford to do it? Can you do all that? But if you've got a passion to do something, do it. You're not going to have that sitting at a desk job. Whether it's a desk job or restaurant worker job or some other business, with so many people quitting, how will employers survive? Employers are going to have to get really creative uh, to, to attract the type of workers they want because it's not only money, it's also quality of life. Now there's almost always going to be a remote component. From helping pay for daycare to four day work weeks to flex schedules, everything's on the table right now. In Colorado, unemployment is relatively low, 4.9 percent. But the so-called quit rate is fairly high, 3.3 percent. The look on their face like, Oh my God, that's really good. I'm like, that's fresh roasted coffee. That's that's what you should be drinking. <laughs> and for people like Dawn, it's not so much the great resignation as the great reassignment. She says now's the perfect time to do what makes you happy and good coffee makes her happy. Right now, an average of about 4 million people a month are quitting their jobs. Many critics have said it's because some of them are lazy and would rather rely on unemployment benefits and handouts. But statistics don't back that up. Most are actually back in the labor market, just switching things up. We will have more on the great resignation or maybe the great reassignment, as it seems, coming up tomorrow morning.